Today's video is presented in partnership with Hampson Auctions, one of the UK's leading classic, performance and supercar auction houses. Their next sale takes place on the 9th of March at the magnificent Bowlesworth Castle in Cheshire. Hi everybody, welcome back to Rich Reviews. We're driving our courtesy car today, which is BMW 320i, because our Lotus Amira is in having the nine issues resolved and it's there all week, so we've got this courtesy car all week. Just to give you some quick stats on this courtesy car, it's a straight four, two litre twin turbo, and it pushes out 181 brake horsepower, 221 pound foot of torque, not to 62 in a heady 7.4 seconds, and a top speed of 146 miles per hour. So it's not gonna break any records for performance, but that's not what it's about. It's got pretty inert steering. It's, you know, very, very compliant on the roads, probably too compliant. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna give you an end of week ownership experience for this car, because we've got it all week. So we'll see how the car performs, we'll get used to it, and then at the end of the week, we'll create you a video just to give an appreciation of what it's been like owning this car all week. But today's video is different. It's not gonna be a car review. You may notice that I'm not wearing a watch today. And that's because we're gonna do something a bit different. We've got an unboxing that we're gonna be doing for you today. This is a very specialized watch in how the dial was created, in fact, how the whole case was created, the case back and the crystal and the dial and the hands even. Only 150 of these watches will ever be made. So very unique, very bespoke. And the reason for that very, very limited production run is because they are a nightmare to make. And again, when I reveal it, you'll get an appreciation of why they're a nightmare to make and why nobody wants to, or why this company never wants to make another 150 of these again. We'll get to somewhere scenic, I'll pull over and we'll do a unique unboxing of this, of this stunning micro brand timepiece. So we've pulled over somewhere quiet to perform this unboxing of this very, very bespoke timepiece. Isotope is a company that was inaugurated around eight years ago and this particular timepiece is manufactured and designed in collaboration between Isotope and Revolution. And this, this piece is called the Isotope Mercury and when you see the watch you'll totally get it why it's called the Mercury. Now the presentation of the delivery of this watch is just bar none, very very impressed with it. First of all you have this travel pouch that the watch comes with this nice soft travel pouch which of course is branded with the company name isotope you put that to one side the box itself is branded isotope and very well put together nicely designed box we just take the lid off the box now to show you the actual timepiece put the lid to one side now first of all you're presented with this beautiful old style butterfly box case box or watch box which is brings back memories and heralds back to olden days when old style jewelry and legacy jewelry or wasn't so legacy back then of course was presented in, in this type of butterfly format where you have a press stud at the top which holds the two halves together and you open up that press stud and then you're presented with this beautiful timepiece as you open up the two halves and this is why it's called the isotope mercury just look at that dial immaculate mirror finish the isotope mercury is the only convex dialed mirror polished timepiece in existence. This is the first timepiece to feature this type of a dial. And you can see it's absolutely flawless. Only 150 of these has ever been manufactured and will only ever be manufactured. In actual fact, there's one that is available at the moment. So if you are interested in this timepiece, then get yourself across to Isotope Sharpish because that timepiece is gonna go very, very quickly. In fact, it might have gone by the time this video is delivered live. This piece is all about the dial. But there are some interesting aspects to the manu general manufacture of this timepiece as well. First of all, the, as I detailed before, the dial is convex and it's heavily mirrored and polished to be able to, or heavily polished to produce that mirrored effect. But the case back, as I'll show you in a minute, is concave. 
yet the sapphire crystal is convex as well. And because the dial itself is convex, it means that the hands have to run the same contour of the dial and of course have to fit between the crystal and the dial. Therefore, they have to run the same contour of the crystal, which is also convex, which means that the hands have to be bent. And to be able to achieve the exact bend to map across that dial, the hands have to be hand bent. So a lot of these watches is hand made. And of course, the dial is hand polished to create that mirror finish. It's just an incredible piece of engineering. As you move the dial around, it follows all the contours and all the aspects of everything in its surroundings. So it mirrors around all its subjects that, that are in its enclosure, which is part of the fun of this watch. And yes, there's no markers on this watch. It's not all about telling the time, of course. This watch is all about the look. And it is an incredible, beautiful looking watch. The manufacturer of the dial has requires many iterations of polishing and then rhodium plating. So it's polished, rhodium plated, then polished again and rhodium plated. And there's multiple iterations of that until they get the dial exactly perfect, exactly how they want it. And as I said, then the dial is fitted within this sandwich of this convex sapphire crystal. And as I take the watch out now and show you this beautiful presentation case back, which is in itself concave. You can see there the presentation of the mechanism. Very, very beautifully designed. You can see the brand in there as well. It's, it's still got a sticker on the back. So um, that red line there isn't a, a manufacturing fault. It's just that they've still got the actual sticker on the back. This watch was literally delivered to me this morning. So we, we wanted to get out quickly to show you this timepiece because there's only one available. Just wanted to give you the opportunity to buy the last one if you were interested. As I say, only 150 of these watches will ever be made, and this is very, very specialised. Now, to protect the case, which is in itself heavily polished, that has an anti-scratch coating applied to the case. And that is quite a durable coating, but it's not infallible. I believe the coating will last about a year in extensive, fairly heavy use. But if it's periodically used, so if you keep this watch in your collection, then it should last a fair bit longer, that, that coating. Are you looking to buy a supercar or sports car? We can help you. Rich Reviews makes the luxury car buying process simple and stress-free. Whether you're looking to buy your first supercar or add a car to your collection, our services include expert telephone support calls, pre-purchase inspection and car collection videos. Rich Reviews takes care of all the details so you can just sit back and enjoy a hassle-free purchase process. But don't just take our word for it. Check out some of the testimonials from our customers below. Contact us today via the comments below or at the following email address. Thank you for your time. It's just, as you, can, as you can appreciate, it's just a beautifully designed watch. And the reason why the case back was designed concave and the crystal convex, more so the case back con concave, is so that it is a very slim fit on your wrist. Now, lug to lug is 44.5 millimeters, but as you can see there, it's a beautiful fit to your actual wrist and fits very slim. So it's very much a talking piece. It'll fit nicely under the cuff of a shirt and you can wear it as a sporty watch as well. And this has 100 meters water resistance, which is very, very impressive considering it hasn't got a screw down crown and it hasn't got a screw down case back. It's a screwed case back, not a screwed down case back. And that meant they had to go through some quite interesting um, approaches to put this together, of course, so that they, so that because of not having the screw down crown and screw down case back to provide that 100 meters water resistant. So that in itself is very, very impressive. I believe also the seconds sub dial is flat. So the hand for the seconds flub sub dial had to be manufactured flat. Um, and they had to polish that section of the dial in a separate manner into how they polished the rest of the dial as well. So it's just, the whole thing is just a very, very impressive. And because it was such a nightmare to manufacture, and as you can imagine, putting this watch together, you've got to make sure there's not one particle of dust in the environment. And when you're putting it together, you know, you cannot find a little blemish on the dial when you've put it together and they think, oh, frickin' it, we've got to, you know, separate it out and, and then repolish it again. It's just hell, it's absolutely hell. 
The parts for this watch are supplied, or many of the parts are supplied from Switzerland, and it's assembled in Switzerland. And it was assembled by a specialist third party company chosen specifically because they were only one of the companies that could provide the approach to put this watch together to provide that sort of presentation so that the dial wasn't impacted in any way and wasn't compromised. Very, very impressive. It's an absolutely stunning watch. I really love it. It's a, it's a great addition to my collection. The watch also has easy removable uh, straps on it as well. So you just have to pull that little bar to the left hand side or to the right hand side as you can see it on camera and the strap will easily detach. So you can easily fit other straps to this watch and there are other straps available as well. This is the standard strap that comes with this, the standard, um, this soft, very light white silver strap, which is very, very befitting with this type of mirror dial. You can get a slightly grayer strap as well, which is also works well with this dial. As I say, only 150 of this isotope mercury will have ever been made and there's only one available at the moment. So I'm very, very pleased and thank you very much, Jose, for allowing me to purchase this watch. And I'm very, very fortunate to be able to have access to these sort of timepieces. It's just a very, very stunning watch. Isotope, um, in collaboration with Revolution, are very much a micro brand. So it's micro brand, so they only manufacture very small production runs of these types of watches. And that enables them to keep the prices down. Um, yeah, you'd think a small production run would actually mean that the prices were quite high, but because obviously they can mitigate a lot of the cost with marketing, etc., they can keep their prices down. And this is very, very reasonably priced. And say, so if you're interested, get yourself across to Isotope. Even if there are no more of this Isotope Mercury available, then have a look at their other timepieces there, because they're very much an up and coming brand now. Very, very bespoke timepieces. So that's it. I just wanted to show you this beautifully designed Isotope Mercury timepiece and how it's presented in this beautiful butterfly display box. Very, very beautifully put together. Just great design. I just love it when you get these, these micro brands that provide the timepieces in this sort of manner. It just makes watch collecting just that much more special. Thank you very much, Jose, and thank you very much, Isotope, Isotope Revolution, for manufacturing the Isotope Mercury. Really love this timepiece and it's going to be a great addition to my collection.